Hey everyone, just wanted to make a quick video on how you can connect your hosting your domain to your Framer website. It's pretty simple to do, so I'll go ahead and show you how to do it right now. So first you want to open up the Framer website that you want to add the domain to. Then you want to go to the top right where it says publish and click on where it says add domain. Now, if you don't see this button, you may need to upgrade your Framer project to a premium plan in order to actually add the domain. As you can see, I have the mini plan for this project. So you're gonna to need to make sure you have that in order to actually add the domain. But once you do that, go ahead and click on where it says add domain. Next, you want to scroll down to where you see custom domain. And here we want to select connect a domain you own. From here, we're gonna enter in our domain name. So mine is evandoestech.online. And then click on where you see the checkmark box. Now we're gonna to need to configure our DNS records on our domain in order to match these. So what we can do is go to our domains page on our hosting or dashboard. You can get here by going to the sidebar under the domain section and clicking on where it says domain portfolio. And then I'm gonna select this domain right here and click on where it says manage. Next, I'm gonna to go to the DNS and name servers and click on where it says edit. Now here's where we're gonna to need to add in those CNAME records and the A records that we see here. So the first type is an A record. We're gonna go ahead and copy this value we're gonna keep the name and add symbol, paste in that value, and then click on where it says add record. Next, we're gonna need another A record. So I'm gonna go ahead and copy this value, come back over to Hostinger, select a A record, have an add symbol for the name, and then make the target this IP and click on where it says add record. Lastly, we're gonna need this C name record. So I'm gonna go ahead and copy this value. For the type, we're gonna set this to C name. For the name, we're gonna change this to www. And for the target, we're gonna enter in this value. So if we go ahead and click on where it says add record, now we can see that our records match the one on Framer here. And now we can see that our custom domain has been connected. It may take up to 48 hours for the changes to take effect, but we can see that this now says optimize. And if you don't see this, you might need to click the refresh button that should be under these three dots right here. But again, this process may take up to 48 hours to actually work. But that's how you can connect your hosting your domain to your Framer website.